Who? <laughs> OG Bossy here bringing you another great class setup. Today we're going to be using the Bossy Bettys. What you're going to need is lightweight, scavenger, extreme conditioning, bouncing Bettys, shock charge, and for those wild cards you're going to need part 2 greed so you can get the fast hands. You're going to need that danger close so you can get that double Betty action. And guess what? You're going to add on an extra shock charge. There you go. Primary and secondary. Oh, what, what, what? We already filled it out. 10 out of 10 because you don't need that shit. Here we go. The OG Bossy Betty's class has two setups. You're going to use the same class loadout, but once you get in the game, it's your call. One, you use no guns whatsoever, just your knife, Betty's, and shock charges and kill streaks. And the second one, you're allowed to use the guns. And what I mean is, once you're completely out of Betty's, you're allowed to pick up the enemy's gun that you just killed and use that gun if needed. If you go to the next guy and you kill him and you resupply your Betty's, you need to use those Betty's first. It's required. Alright, so as soon as you load the map, you want to run, have a game plan. So start running towards the high traffic areas. Get up there, throw down your shark charge, throw down your Betty's, and wait out. You're guaranteed to get the first kill because everybody runs to the middle. It's guaranteed. Once you get that down, you want to start making a, a routine, you know, like a little map. So think about the high traffic areas and work your way back and just keep doing that same cycle. Like you've seen this video, I keep tossing it up here in the balcony. That's a high traffic area. Everybody's always up there. And you won't ev you won't always get them up there in the same time every time. But what you got to do is just keep practicing and you'll get it perfect. Now, I'm not advocating camping, but you are bringing a knife to a gunfight, especially when you've already used all your Bettys. Freeze frame. Check out this clip. I have no Bettys. There is three guys. What do you do? What do you do, bossy? Well, I'm about to show you. What you do is you run up, pick one guy, knife him, resupply your ammunition, which in this case would be your Bettys. Throw down a Betty, throw down a shot charge, and dive. Get the fuck out of there, because that shit's about to blow up. Alright, so you're in a high traffic area, so what do you do? You throw down your Bettys, check out your mini-map, find someone, go get them, knife them, grab their Bettys, and toss them down immediately. After you kill someone and you hear that screech or it's fucking bullshit. Oh, it gives me goosebumps every time when I use this class because it is just so rejuvenating. It brings back that Call of Duty experience that I once loved, you know, when I first got the game. Great. And because you're not taking the game all that serious, you want to get the positive KD, but you're not stressed about it. You're having fun with it. That's what this class is all about. Having fun with the game that you bought. Now, with this type of class, you're going to want to have your score streaks stacked. And most of you always, you know, already do this anyway, so it's not even a big deal. But you want to have them close together so that once you enable one, you get the next one. Boom, 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 boom. You know, just write down, chain them up. And you're not going to always go positive with this type of class. It's going to take some time getting used to. You aren't used to playing this way. You're used to running a gun or, you know, camping and sniping. This takes a lot of time. This is going to take a little bit of effort. But it's going to be fun while you're playing it because you're just going to love the reward you get from playing this game. Another key strategy to this game type, this class mode, is you want to do the sneak attack, the fake out. And what I mean is, once you run and you see this guy in the window, you want to run on past him. Because usually they'll either chase you and you can throw down a bedding and let him walk into it. Or they'll think you just went on about your day. And that's the best scenario. So what you'll do is you'll run back up to that same spot. You go in there and you knife them. Such a satisfaction. Now this class is going to be mostly about you waiting it out. It's a lot of running, but when, once you throw down your baddies and get all set up, you want to wait out to that first kill because you know someone's going to be coming around the corner. And like I said earlier, you're bringing a knife to a gunfight, so you have to wait it out. You're not camping. You're just being strategic. And playing this class is going to make you a better player because once you go back to, you know, we'll call it the regular mode where you actually use guns, you'll go back and you'll realize, hey, I'm going to take just a little bit of extra time here going around this corner. I'm going to take a little bit of extra time you know, going around here. You just, you're a little bit more cautious of how your gameplay is. And that's why this class is so awesome. It's fun to play, and it's going to make you a better player. It's a win-win combo. Do you like throat? I love throat. Check this out. Boom. And sometimes, like I said, you want to use the other class loadout where you're allowed to use the guns. And 
And sometimes you slip up, like I did right here, and I just started shooting the guy, and obviously I had another Betty, but you couldn't throw it. I, mean, I tried throwing it, and I couldn't get it up there. And it's, at that angle, I could not get it, it up. I start shooting, shooting, and I see some other guys running up. I have no Bettys, but then I see that scavenger bag. So I run up, get it, dive, and toss that Betty down. And that's what it's all about right there. That is how it's done. Now for the bossy challenge, what I want you to do is get a direct impact kill. The more, the merrier. Or get a try kill with one Betty. That is the challenge for this week. This has been OG Bossy from Comic Lane. Keep owning.